All right, what's up YouTube? We got a box break of a normal booster box of Ikoria today. Um, before we get started, let's do a quick dice. Actually, no, let's do a quick randomization of our five sponsors today. And all right, this will be our order. Uh, let's just put it in the camera so everyone can see. All right, so we got uh, Ducey first, Ducey, Tommy, uh, Tony, Ellie, Adamo, and the last 12 packs will be going to James. Let's roll a dice. We'll go down one through five. Uh, sorry, one through six. James will be five and six. First, who gets the box topper? All right, let's roll the dice. Four. So that means Adamo will be getting the box topper. And let's go ahead and get started with Ducey's first six packs i actually got my box cutter today so this will be a little bit easier to do and i said i'll do the first six packs and uh, you know what i'll open the box topper when i get to adam keep some suspense in there so box topper when we get to adam all right all right all right all right I haven't done one of these in a while. I've actually just didn't have any on hand. And uh, a bunch of you guys asked for them, so I got them. All right, so what we'll do is I'll just do six here in the first row, then six, then six, and then go down six, six, six again. All right, let's see what we get. Oh yeah, these are the hard to open ones with little the tab. All right. Pack one, let's see, let's see. Ooh. All right, so these have the rare in front, so it's gonna be a little anticlimactic. Um, maybe, you know what, I'll start, I'll start from the back. No, 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 we'll just start from the front. It's fine, you can see the rare first. I think the commons and uncommons at this point are a little less exciting. They're not even foil, they're not even foily boys. So I'll do the rare, um, show the uncommons, and then kind of just blitz through the commons. All right, token. Basic Land, and Obosh, the Prey Piercer, Mr. Com Companion. Nice hit, nice hit. Here we have our Uncommons, Zagoth Crystal, Jubilant Skybonder, and Footfall Crater. And we'll go through the Commons real quick. All right, all right. Next pack. There we go. Got our arena card. Here is a Blossoming Sands, and our rare is Skycat Sovereign. Not bad, not bad. Sweet hit, sweet hit. And our uncommons are Duskfang Mentor, Boon of the Wishgiver. This is like an all star in a draft. And a Grim Dancer, also very solid. Right, put the uncommons over here. And here are commons. Super great common, in my opinion, for uh, draft. And let's get through these other guys. Sweet. All right, let's do pack three. All right, we'll try to use a full tab. All right, token. Basic land, here comes a rare. Genesis ultimatum. Sweet. And here comes our uncommons. Stormwild, Majestic Aracorn, back for more. And we got some commons. All right, all right. Let's take a peek at pack number four. Let's keep using that pull tab. Oh. Wow, okay, so I just need to learn how to use a pull tab better, because that was amazing. All right, here's our counters uh, card and basic lands. Oh, 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 I mythic hit General Kudro of Dranith. I've been seeing this card used pretty well in the Modern Humans deck, and, uh, you know, if you look at the fact that it has three lines of text, is a three-man, a three-three, and is a human, it's just like, all right, all right. 
It's just a solid card. Here we go with our uncommons. Lead the Stampede, Avian Oddity, and Trumpeting Gnar. Put these guys away. And we've got some commons. All right. Pack five. Oh, right, 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 right. But I use the, the pull tab. Oh, okay. So sometimes I get there, sometimes I don't with the pull tab. Okay. Got our foil blood fell caves. Throw that in here. And an eerie ultimatum. They're rare. Not bad. Not bad. So eerie. They're like back from the grave. <laughs> All right. Here's Sanctuary Lockdown. Polywog Symbiote. Porky Parrot. Parrot. And we got some comments. Oh, I'm so... Okay, so I forgot to show a timestamp. It's now 11.04. I started around 10.56. Okay, here we go. Okay, pull tab is just not not that friendly for me. Can't can't get it to work most of the time. All right, here comes the next pack. Got a token, got a land, and our rare is em what emergent ultimatum. That's like three ultimatums in the first six packs, and we got some uncommons, and we got some commons. Yeah, just to be clear, here are the six rares and mythics. Mythic General Kudro. Not a bad pack. Just uh, weird that we got three ultimatums. <laughs> you know, a little weird. All right, that's for Duse. And we will... Oh gosh, I'm pronouncing your name wrong. I'm so sorry. Super sorry. You can uh, correct me in the comments. And then I will say sorry again. All right, here we go. Tony, the next six packs. Six is six. Yeah, six. Alright, six packs, and let's get cracked. So these are going to be for Tony. We got our arena card. And our land. Our rare is Death's Oasis. Pretty sweet looking card. And our uncommons. Parcel Beast. I think Parcel Beast might actually see a decent amount of play in standard if you think about it. Um, turn one mana dork. Turn two this guy. And immediately tap the mana dork to use the effect. So, I don't know, it could be not that bad. And we got some commons. Sweet, sweet, sweet. All right. Let's get something super good for pack two. I'm feeling, I'm feeling something good. All right. There you go. Token. And a land. And a foil, Shredded Sails. And Umori, the Collector. All right, not, not too great, but hey, the Companions are all pretty good. This this one might be the worst though, that, that's for sure. Um, here we've got some Uncommons. And Almighty Brushwag. And some other Commons. All right. Let's open pack three. Okay, I've not successfully gotten the, the full open on that. I think I did it that first time. All right, I got a token. Basic land. Here comes our rare. Ah, yes! A triome! Great hit, great hit. And then we got our uncommons. And our comments. All right, not too bad, not too bad. All right, so that's three packs in. We got 
uh, three more packs for Tony. Let's see if we can get another mythic hit. Should be getting a mythic per uh, what? Two, two to three per box? Is that is that how it works? I guess I can just read the pack. How often are mythics showing up? Uh, I don't know. It doesn't, it doesn't say here. All right. Here we got our token, our land, and nice, a Dranif Magistrate. Which uh, formats will this see play? Probably a lot of them. It's just really good hate bear. Also a human, which is not irrelevant. And here are our uncommons. Lord Dracus, sweet showcase. And we got some comments. All right. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Two more packs, Tony. Two more packs. All right. Here's our token. Here's our land. And our rare, Mythos of Aluna. Monstrous Step. Boneyard Lurker, Skull Prophet are our uncommons. And then here's a couple of commonos. I guess we call them just common boys. Yeah, nice. It's two for two on these uh, blister tab openings. Okay. Got our token, got our basic land, and oh, that's a sweet one. I'm hacks. Excited and happy for you. The Ozolith. That pretty sweet, and we got some uncommons, and we got some comments. All right, those are for you, Tony. Let's put these cards away and do a quick review of the rares Ozolith, Mythos of Aluna. Dranif Magistrate, a Zagoth Trium, Umori the Collector, and Death's Oasis. All right, all right, all right. All right, next up, Ellie. Six packs for you. There are six right here. Six. All right. Okay, let's open some more packs. I mean, these, uh... You know, I, I opened three collector boxes in the last 24 hours, so yeah, these aren't as exciting, but still, I'm trying to imagine a lot of these packs. What would I be taking pack one, pick one? What would I be taking pack one, pick two? Shark token, tap land, foil, unpredictable cyclone. All right, foil rare, kind of wasted on this, but uh, you know, good to at least get one. Oh, what a great start. Indata Triome? Oh, Triome. I forgot that uh, you could get them in these uh, normal booster boxes, but this is sweet. Oh, the art on these, I mean, it's, it's just so sweet. Like, every time I look at the art, I'm like, I realize there's something else. Like, there's like these like bat like creatures flying around. Ah, oh, so great. What a, what a great hit. Double rare pack, too. And we got our uncommons. And we got some comments. Like, you know, like I would probably take the Triome in this pack. Assuming the Triome's not there, I'd probably take uh, like maybe the Huntmaster Liger. Uh, you know, pack one, pick one. Fire Prophecy is also pretty good. Dream Tail Heron's also insanely good. So, a lot of good hits. Um, once you draft the format a decent amount of time, you like start realizing, oh, wh what should I prioritize? What should I not prioritize? So. Yeah, instant speed removal, always great. Mutate that, you know, cantrips, always great. And uh, sometimes you just force cycling decks. The, the cycling deck is the hilar most hilarious deck of my core, in my opinion. Because you have all these monsters and like, sometimes you have like a dominant board and then they just Zenith flare you for like eight and then nine. And you're like, okay, I guess all that work was for nothing. <laughs> all right, basic land. And our rare is a Mythos of Vadrock. And here comes our uncommon, Zagoth Mamba. Cunning Nightbonder, which I think we'll see play in standard. Like it just, it, it all adds up to be pretty good. Um, a Splendor Mare. And then we got some commons.
All right, on to the next pack. I'm like worried that if I use the blister tab, I'm damaging the card, so be careful here. Here comes our token, our basic land, and our rare is a cub ward. You know, for a cat, this thing looks, I don't know, kind of like a cat beast, you know? Do you see the little cubs in the background? I love how, that, that was definitely in the uh, artist instructions, in the artist notes, so solid card. Uh, it's, it's one of those cards that's like, Deceptively powerful, in my opinion, because um, two one one white ca cat tokens with lifelink is just such a powerful effect. So, appropriately, it costs it at a rare. Um, I think elementors are insanely good for limited, so always excited to see them. Neutralize is okay in the format. I think the fact that it has cycling might be better than the fact that it's a three mana counter spell. Um, this card's okay, the Halbonder. And then we got our commons. Yeah, no, no real notes on most of these commons. All right. Three more packs for you, Ellie. Although I must say you've already done handsomely with the uh, Alt Art Triome in a normal booster pack. All right. Got a mountain of pack trash. It's building up. All right. Token, land, and rare. Whirlwind of Thought. Whenever you cast a non-creature spell, draw a card. Will I play this in limited? Probably not, but uh, it's definitely really, really good in EDH decks, I bet, or combo decks. Um, here we go for our Crystal, Porky Parrot, Trumpeting Gnar, so our uncommons, and let's go through some of the commons. All right, here comes our next pack for Yelly. This is uh, pack number five. Having trouble opening this one as well. So far, not too bad. Not too bad hits. We'd like some more mythics. Maybe, I don't know, a foil mythic, a foil rare. Land, and here's our rare. Okay, just kidding. This is a foil uncommon. Pretty sweet, and inspired ultimatum. Very, very nice. Uh, one of my favorite ultimatums. And we got some commons and uncommons. Mysterious egg. And we'll just blitz right through them. All right. One more pack. Let's get this guy opened. All right. Arena card. Basic land. Mythos of Nethroi. God, I love these arts. Look at this. It's kind of like a caveman painting, actually. Oh my god, he's... Oh, I just realized the art. He's eating something, and there's already something in his stomach. Spooky, man. Spooky. All right, then we got our Poliwig, Poliwog Symbiote. Skybonder. Blitz of the Thunder Raptor. And some uncommons. Or some commons. Sweet. Get right through those. Ellie, you had some of the best pulls of the day, so congrats. Just to go through some of the hits you got, um, you know, a couple rares, foil uncommon Skull Prophet, that might be a cubable card, a foil rare unpredictable Cyclone, and then Indatha Triumph. Not too shabby, not too shabby at all. Okay, put the cards over here. And we for Adam. Let's start with the box topper that you won off the dice roll. All right. Let's try not to damage this. Ooh, I can tell it's a good one. Hey! Mr. DC Foil. Look. Showing it to my wife who's just sitting on the couch. <laughs> wow, Adam. This dice roll really, really, really counted for something, eh? All right. In case you didn't already have one, here's another one. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, now uh, we'll grab these six packs and we'll keep rolling. All right. I could tell that it was uh, one of the better ones because at this point I've memorized the color scheme of the uh, 
the other uncommons. So that's like Hollywood, Symbiote, the, uh, uh, well, that's Baby Godzilla, rather, um, King Caesar, and um, can't even think, oh, uh, Godzilla, normal Godzilla, Primeval Champion. Okay, so here's our token, here's our basic land. Straight up foil rare, nice to start things off. Very nice, Slither Wisp, and a Extinction Event as our normal rare. Then we got some uncommons. Uno, dos, tres, and then we got some commons. Common boys, blitzing right through those. All right, here comes pack two. So no, not too many exciting mythics. I mean, I know the last last box break, uh, last box break we did. We had like alt art showcase, uh, planeswalker. Um, we just had some sweet hits last time, but uh, so far none of them have shown up here. Here's a frontland Felida, but you know we still have half the box left, so it's not like it's impossible to see them. And then we got some comments. All right, all right. Here's another box, or here's another pack for you, Adam. Let's see how it goes. The uh, the Godzillas are, uh, I mean, I think they're just so like some of the uncommons are worth very little. And then, you know, the Mythics and Mr. DC are just worth so much more. Here's our basic lands. A foil. Avian Oddity. Idaro, the Wandering Monster. Mr. Dinosaur Turtle. One of you guys is watching this, and uh, I know what you're about to type. You're about to type Dinosaur Turtle, all caps, with a space in between each letter. And uh, I would say, you know, Great for you, I'm glad you like them. <laughs> All right, we got some uncommons. And then we got some comments. Sweet. All right, three more packs for you, Adam. And then we will be... Ooh. All right, let's... we'll be uh, two thirds of the way done with this box. So still a lot of chances for sweet opens. Like this one. Oh my gosh, I called it. No, I didn't call it. I've just been saying like this one like every time, but nice, a mythical hit. Luca, Copper Coat Outcast. It's him with his Patagia Tiger, which is also one of the cards. And, uh, you know, just great to hit a mythic Planeswalker. I'd probably take that first if I was in this pack. Put the cards away, Escape Protocol, Zena Flare. I'd probably take that if I saw this, you know, in the first, I don't know, I want to say like two packs, I might still grab it because just a fun deck to play. Nice hit, nice hit. Right. Yank those cards out. And we got our token. Alright, can we get another epical hit here? Zerda, the Dawn Waker. Not a bad hit. Not a bad hit. I think this guy's only like five bucks right now, but, you know, the fact that he might see legacy play is just insane. So, great hit, great hit. Then we got some uncommons and some commons. All right, one more pack for Adam. Let's get right to it. Oh my gosh, Alt Art Mythic. Oh man, Adam, you saw all the good cards from the box. Not foil, but still very, very nice. Jeez, Nethroi, Apex of Death. Wow, kind of does look kind of weird, like janky. Like this art's not the most epic. Kind of looks like a like a deer that's like dying and like mutated, but uh, very powerful effect, very powerful card. Death Touch and Life Link. All right, then we got some uncommons, and then we got some commons. All right, those were your opens, Adam. Here, let's just go through what you opened. So a bunch of sweet ones. And then, you know, Mythic, followed by Zerda, followed by another Mythic. Let's put these bad boys away. Oh, yeah, and I forgot. Of course, there's this guy as well. All for you, Adam. Thanks for sponsoring me. Congrats on the box topper. All right, and now we got James. 
James, you got 12 packs coming your way. The rest of the box. And uh, let's get right to it. All right. So we've seen a couple of mythics, but I think we, you know, I think we could, you know, we would be due for another. It wouldn't be that bad. It wouldn't hurt at all. All right, we got a token. Land. Foil Convolute, followed by a Labyrinth Raptor. All right, we could do better than that. We got some uncommons. And we got some commons. All right, all right. Let's see what the next pack brings us. Anything exciting out there? All right, got the token card. Basic land. In our rare, Gigantha, the Wellspring. And we got some uncommons. And we got some comments. All right. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Okay, so here we go. A mythic! Shaville, Bane of Monsters. Is that chest hair or is that a necklace? Oh, it's both. <laughs> it's both. Wow, so manly. All he's done here is like crack some eggs. <laughs> but he looks so epic. Like he thinks he's like the hot stuff. Is he the hot stuff? Maybe he is. I don't know. All right, we got some uncommons. And we got commons. All right, onward and forward, we got another Mythic. So I guess the chances of another Mythic are, have uh, decreased substantially. Cause uh, I think it's like what, three or four Mythics already? Token, basic land, and a foil basic land, and a rare, Offspring's Revenge. All right, then we got a Bastion of Remembrance and some other uncommons. And we got some comments. All right. Here comes our token, our land, a foil, showcase glowstone recluse. Very, very nice. A dirge bat. Probably will see play in standard as a one of. The mutate effect is obviously very powerful, but it's so much mana. And you need to have a creature. Weaponize the monsters, Pouncing Shore Shark, and Survive Thunder Mane. All right, then we got uh, some commons. All right, all right. Oh, wow. See, first time I'm seeing one of these companion uh, cards. Um, you'd expect to see a lot more of these, but I've seen like one or two per box max as a token. So that token might actually hold value. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, speaking of things that hold value, Lures of the Dream Den. Uh, I don't know if you've kept up the, the, you know, all the eternal formats, but this card is, uh, people speculate he's going to get banned because it's just uh, <laughs> it's a very, very good card. We'll find out soon. Got some uncommons. And we got some commons. Like, it's funny because the mechanic really hasn't been released for too long and it's just, it's really taking over. Like, like you're at a disadvantage of not playing a companion in most of the formats where companion is legal now. Actually, I'd say all the formats. All right, got our token, got our land. Ruinous Ultimatum is our rare, sweet. And uh, got some uncommons. And got some comics. All right, all right, here we go. We got five more packs, I believe. Yep, five more packs. And we'll wrap this video up. Um, I uh, wanna mention that the giveaway is still on, still active. It's for the video released earlier this morning. Um, please comment there. 
that's the one I'll be using. Here's a foil garrison cap for a random picker, a random comment picker. Here's a song of creation rare. And here comes our uncommons. All right, here's our comments. Oop, put the uncommons in the wrong spot. Oh no, I started a new comment pile. I just didn't even realize it. All right, here we go with a oh, grab it. All right, token. Basically, here comes our rare. It's not a rare. It's a mythic. Real the Everwise. Sweet, sweet hit. I think this card's gonna, it's a sleeper. That's what I'm calling it, sleeper. And we got some comments. Reason why I think it's a sleeper is just the injury action, mainly with Lion's Eye Diamond. Um, and the fact that it is not just a zero three, it could be like a, you know, 15 three in the right deck. Here comes our counter card. Land and our rare is oh wow, it's not a rare, it's a mythic. Bad rock, apex of thunder. Somehow this is a dinosaur cat. Like, who thought about that? Eh? Wait, that's like three mythics in a row. Oh, we'll we'll go through them at the end, but that was cool. All right, and then we got some comments. All right, two more packs. Two more packs. Can we get an alt art something? I don't know, like a triumph? <laughs> that too much to ask for? All right. Token, land, and a mythos of Brokos. Okay. Here comes our uncommons and our comics. All right. Last pack. Last pack. Hope for some spicy lucky hits. It's. it's a token land and okay foil essence scatter very nice very nice and a okay ask for an alt art got something alt art cup warden uh showcase art sweet 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 and of course our wolf bear and some other uncommons like flame spill and our comments all right that's it for now Giveaway is still live on the, uh, I'll, I'll link the YouTube that, uh, the, sorry, the video that it's live on. Um, just, you know, like, subscribe, add a comment, and I'll do a random picker tomorrow, Friday, uh, April 20, sorry, May 1st. Um, I have an email link as well for people who are interested in box breaks. Uh, as you may have seen from the last video, I have a, a few more of these, so just, you know, hit me up. And I'll let you know just all the terms and stuff. And uh, yeah, that should be it. Thank you all for watching. Thank you, my sponsors, for sponsoring. And until next time.